Hello, my friends. I'm here to show you what um, the collage that I did in Karen's circle journal. Look at the beautiful cover that she made for her book. Oh my goodness, it's all painted. That's just splattered. She's got writing in here on silver. It's just, wow. And on the inside, she has done the same. See that? Look at the brightness. That's wonderful. So happy to work in Karen's journal. Here is the page that I did. I use digitals from Shabby Cottage Studio on Etsy. And I just loved uh, the collage. And, you know, you get collage papers. They're just so gorgeous on their own. What do you do with them? So I just started by taking a piece off from there, inking it. And I just put a little um, Tim Holtz label on there. And on this one here, the same thing. I cut it out and I put a little label there and it didn't do much except just inking. I was considering doing some more uh, crackle paste on stenciling, but I left it. And this one, this uh, inclusion was just a brown paper bag. So I covered it on this side with some uh, vintage ledger paper and some washi tape and another Tim Holtz uh, label piece. And then this was just a scrap left over from, you know, one of the sheets. And then this, I just did a little collage. I wanted to keep that in there because I just love that little thing. I had to sacrifice the butterfly. And here is a, it's just a window envelope. And in here, I put another piece from the paper. And that is just a nice little bird in there. And I glued it shut. Normally, I keep them interactive where you can pull them out through the top and slide them back in again. So this one, I just glued shut. And then I've got two... Uh, leftover pieces. I collaged uh, scraps on the back and then I just made a little tag or tab and I'll just pop those in there and she can do what she likes with those. Use them or leave them in there. Pull them out. I like things. I like things that tuck in and slide in. I like it to be a little bit interactive. I still may do a little stenciling on here or something. Not sure but for now this is what it is, and I know that Karen likes flowers and birds and bright colors, so hopefully, Karen, you're going to love that page. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you again soon. I have another journal to work on probably by next weekend, and I'll share that as well. Thanks. Bye-bye.